Well, God bless you. Thank you for tuning in to Black Man's Kitchen. Yes, I did say Black Man's Kitchen. Well, I think I'm going to go ahead and... I got some pork chops I'm going to do. I haven't had a pork chop in a while. I think I'm going to go ahead and fry me one. Let me see it. I'm going to go ahead and fry it. Then I have four of them. I had a pack of five. I'm going to put them in the crock pot. And I have them tomorrow. I don't know what I'm going to do with them right now. Uh, but they're really nice. Nice size. Put some onions up in there. I don't know what I might do. Some potatoes. Um, but I want me a good hot pork chop. I ain't had a mustard pork chop since uh, Jewtown in Chicago. Wow. So I think I'm going to make me one. Let me get it here on this one side. Right, now, you can see them little lines in there. If you can see them little lines, I took this knife. And I chop like a tic-tac-toe. Go this way and then go this way on the pork chop, both sides. And you talking about tender. I'm going to let that cook a little bit more on that side. And then I'll do the same on the other side. Keep this fire up just a little bit. Because I want to make this really tender. A couple of slices of that wonder soft bread and some hot sauce. You know what I'm talking about. This right here, this hot sauce, that Frank hot red, the red hot. My God, and you use that on everything. Well, thank you for tuning in, Black Man's Kitchen. I show the results what I do with this pork chops.